Our region boasts several top wrestlers in the 132 pound weight class. And as Mark Coons reports for Whitmer's Jaden Sarabia, competing against each other is making them all better. Jaden Sarabia made a name for himself two years ago, winning a state title in the OAC freshman meet, and he continues to improve. You know, technique wise, you know, he got away with a lot of things because of his athleticism, you know, and just being strong. And, and you know, he, he started wrestling at 138 as a freshman, probably only weighing all of 125 pounds, which is where he fit in the lineup. So to see him at a more comfortable weight class, you know, really honed in and, and, and found his technique and what he was good at and what he was bad at and fixed it. And, you know, just just growing his technique in the sport has been awesome to watch. There's moves out there you can teach and teach, but if you go into a match thinking you're losing or not wanting to get it, you're, it's just a mindset. Sarabia is ranked in the top five in the state for Division I, 132 pounds, the same weight class as two-time defending state champion Marcus Blaze from Perrysburg. Going up against other top wrestlers motivates the junior. It drives me, yeah. I practice just knowing that somebody better than me just makes you run harder practice harder, take that shot harder, just drives you. It just shows how strong Northwest Ohio is getting, you know, in wrestling in general. This isn't the only weight class that there's multiple state contenders. And um, it's fun, you know, keeps it competitive. You know, I'm sure everybody's hungry to, to win a state title, and, and we're in that mix. So it's exciting. A state placer a year ago, Sarabia has the drive to return to Columbus and to return even higher on the podium. He just is the individual that's going to do anything at, anything at all to get to where he wants to get to. I mean, he's got lofty goals and, and he's the one running, practicing, you know, studying to, to get where he wants to get to. I mean, every tournament I go into, I'm, I, I like to say like people look at the bracket and not want to wrestle me. And I think that's what drives him the most. He just doesn't want to lose. He's always, you know, wanting to win. He's got such strong ambition. He's so determined and, and he's gonna reach his goals one way or another. This sport has just grown me in school, any like tests coming up, I tackle it just like I'll tackle a practice or a tournament. Just as a person, nothing's gonna be harder than what I do down there. On the mats, Mark Kuntz, BCSN. Happy to have Coach Coverly back with us in studio. With Jaden Sarabia being as good as he is, as young as he is, obviously it takes physical attributes, but it's gotta for take a little something special up here, right? Oh, for sure. You, Jaden has a high wrestling IQ. This young man understands wrestling from the ground floor to the top. He knows how to move his guys. He understands positional wrestling. He knows how to push a guy, pull a guy, put him in angles, score all the time. I hear all the time in other sports, defense wins championships. Is that true for wrestlers? Absolutely. I am a firm believer in you can't score on me, you're not beating me. And what Jaden does is that he is good at, re he's really good at creating offense off of defense. He'll stop a guy's attack, and as that guy's coming up, lazing his level up, thinking he's safe, boom, Jaden is in on a leg, and the next thing you know, he's got to take now. So we could go here. We talked about Zach Bergman. We just heard Blaze come up again. There are so many good guys who are all fighting in this weight class in Northwest Ohio. Is it a good thing to be given rivals, especially at this stage of your career? Absolutely. You can't ask for a better test than have the top guys in the state in your weight class. And it's only going to make him better. And the old adage in wrestling is, iron sharpens iron. And he's getting sharpened right now. Excited to see what he can get done over the next couple of years and over the next couple months. And excited to have you in here talking about it with us every week. Coach Coverley, thanks for joining us. You're welcome.